Yo, what's going on, you guys? It's Dr. J, and welcome to Call of Duty World War II. And currently, it is it's about an hour since the game has been released. Uh, I'm in the Pacific time, and um, I've been trying to do multiplayer, and the servers have just like crashed because of how many people are trying to get on, which is crazy. Unfortunately, I I can't really play too much multiplayer right now because my internet's not very good, so I have to go over to um, make arrangements to play somewhere else, but for now we're gonna go ahead and click on Nazi zombies because this is what I'm really excited about and scared for because I've seen gameplay and it looks absolutely terrifying <laughs> Dude look at this I'm getting some serious Exo zombie vibes from this Just like how the, the way the cutscene is like these images are moving. It's just like how exo zombies was I love how they go doing this. Dude, these zombies are freaking creepy. Especially this one right here. Oh my god, dude. It's World War II is finally out. I can't believe it. I'm so excited. Oh, uh, dude, this is sick. Okay, I'm hoping that it works for the online too. If it doesn't though, I can just go do a local. Which I don't really mind. And uh, I've already seen a lot of gameplay from... Uh, um, a lot of youtubers uh, who have been posting zombies gameplay and I've even seen some like live streams with uh, the multiplayer like the race that's going on right now for the Call of Duty endowment so that's pretty cool but yeah like this is what I was doing for multiplayer 2 when it just said connecting to online services like for the whole time but then it'll show up like that uh, that they're not available right now so as you can see it's like this so I think we're gonna have to just go do local play most likely which sucks so that I won't be able to get ranked up but uh, hopefully the servers will start to work pretty soon because I want to start getting ranked up okay so do this music though okay so I guess I gotta just do create max because this this is just in local wait I thought there was a uh, two maps wait ready ready up ready up to select your loadout and mark yourself as ready to start this match. Uh, once all players are ready, uh, something okay. Then let me finish it. Okay, so there are two maps in case you guys didn't know, but uh, I guess maybe it's like you have to do the prologue first and then you do it. Uh, this is confusing though because it's like, oh, so you can be Jefferson. Is that who this is right here? It must be Jefferson. Hey, this is Drostan, Marie, and Olivia. I like those names. Those are pretty cool. I like Jefferson, though. I'm just going to stick with him. Uh, problem is, I thought I'm supposed to do some kind of a prologue thing. Loadouts. Now that you've unlocked loadouts, you can modify uh, which ability, which special ability, mods, uh, starting weapon and equipment to bring into a max as you level up you will unlock more starting weapons and equipment that's cool so they've got oh am I concerning my character that's cool uh, and it shows all the weapons that you can start off with free fire is one I put is really good because it gives you unlimited ammo uh, for 30 seconds which is super nice um, let's do Actually, let's just stick with the unlimited ammo. It's called Free Fire. And I want to change the starting pistol. Uh, I like the M1911, but also you could do these weapons, which are really cool. So I think I may go ahead. Well, which is the best one? Um, A accuracy. Fire, it's, fire rate is a little bit slower. Um, so whichever one has this. This pistol seems okay, but it's actually a wall weapon, so I don't really need to buy it. Uh, I think I may just go ahead. I don't know what's the best one to use, to be honest. Uh, let's just... I'm wasting too much time. Wait, 2 out of 12, though? That's the problem. That's low on ammo. 8 out of 96, 7 out of 77, 10 out of 120, but that's the full auto. So, I think, uh, you know, I'll just go with, uh, I'll just go with the M1911. 
Uh, and let's see. Oh, lethal sticky. Um, throwing knife. Oh, that's cool. And, uh, oh, bouncy buddies. That's it. I'll go with the sticky bomb. It kind of looks cool. I saw some gameplay. It looks good. Mods. Uh, shoot, I don't want to read this. Uh, but basically, this is the replacement of Gobble Gums, which is really cool. So, by now, I have all of them unlocked because I'm in local play. So, I'm assuming you have to, like, rank up to unlock certain ones. And by the way, I think the ranking up level is 45, then you prestige and all that stuff. So, what's cool is that they have Mule Kick as an actual mod. So, um, I think that's one of the ones that you get right away. Uh, or maybe it depends on the kind of class you use or whatever, but it's basically Mule Kick as mod, so it's not a perk anymore. Um, so that one's good. So I think I'll take... Oh wait, it's already on there. Oh, okay. Um, free Fire. So it gives you different Free Fire abilities. That's cool. Mark 2. It's upgraded while using Free Fire. Oh, dude, that's sick. Uh, get Headshot Damage Bonus. That's kind of cool. Uh, wait, but what was the armored one? Uh, shoot, this is armored up spawn Spawn and respawn with three points. Of, yeah, so that one's actually gonna be useful Actually, what is resourceful? Which one is that? Uh, this one power-ups last longer um You know, I'm just gonna keep it how it is except I don't want the resourceful. I'd rather have um, let's see, wait, increase max and okay, so I'm not going to read all these, but I think these are kind of cool. So if you guys want to pause it, you can on certain ones. Um, but yeah, I'm going to go back and I'm going to do, uh, armored up. I think that's going to be good. Uh, let's see. And there's more of this stuff. Camouflage, the player is ignored by zombies. That's cool. Uh, free fire that's like when it's like, you know, like unlimited ammo front line nearby zombies chase the user The triggering player deal, uh, deals double damage to zombies for the duration of the special and shell shock creates a burst originating from the player knocks back nearby zombies applies light damage and holds them stunned Dude, this is pretty this is pretty cool um, So that's just that one but okay, so all these are just like Pretty much the same except for my custom class but yeah i think we're gonna go ahead wait what oh shoot weapon build kits so this whole video may end up just being like the whole tutorial of this but uh we'll see how it goes but this is pretty cool it's basically the queer class system um and these are all the weapons that they got dude yo that gun looks pretty cool um stg that's awesome fg42 the bar, the M1941, M1, A1 carbine, grease gun, MP40, PVSH, that's Bay, <laughs> the Thompson, Type 100, and the WAF, which is basically, I guess it's like the Sten, probably, uh, LMG, Bren, I'm pretty sure all these guns are going to be pretty good, dude, MG42, that is so cool, this gun's really good too, um, we got snipers. I don't know what the Commonwealth is. Did they take it out or something? Because it's not in a multiplayer anymore. I checked. Uh, and then we got these shotguns too. Toggle action. I love that shotgun in, uh, in um, what's it called? In Advanced Warfare. Wait, triangle. Camouflage. Oh, we can put camos on now? Wait, paint jobs? Oh, they got paint jobs now? That's sick. Yo, this stuff is cool. What looks the best? Oh, that looks sick, bro. What about the PP? What what looks good on that? Yeah, that looks eh. Yo, that looks pretty nice. These, I like how these are just really simple. Because, like, no, I don't think... I don't know if they're going to do, uh, uh, like, you know, interactive camos or whatever. The ones that, like, move around. I hope not, but, like, if they do, it's an uh, ant. At least make it so it makes sense, you know? Oh, wait, also, I want to check. Um, can... Wait. Can you do extended bags? Dude. Let's go. We got the extended bag. Rapid fire. 
quick draw i'll do grip i'll just do it for a couple of these steady aim better accuracy from the hip that would probably be pretty good increased weapon fire rate uh i probably i like steady and advanced rifle i think that would be good i don't really need to do quick draw um what would what what would the uh oh extended access looks like that the black ops 3 version of the hg40 had like a uh, little clip that uh, for the extended back where it was like a round drum mag that came off over the side which is kind of cool oh i wonder how the uh, extended mag would look here it just sticks out like that yo this is i love this game is gonna be so fun can you do dual wield can't use other attachments with it. That makes sense. <clears throat> Except if it was weird in, in Infinite Warfare, Infinite Warfare, you can have uh, dual wield pistols, but then you can have all these other attachments on it. Uh, high caliber. I think I'd rather do that. Um, let's see. I don't really need it. Aim. Extended mag. That would be nice. And advanced rifling. I already have high caliber, right? Yes. Rifles, what are some of the ones I need? SDG. Uh oh but how would this look? Nice. Oh wait, I just realized why why did the PPSH change color? Uh Okay, I meant to do that. And you can't do radicals, that's kinda weird. I was gonna put the uh, let's see what we got on here. Uh, extended mags, just like this. Oh, that's kind of nice. Um, does that, oh, so, forgot, the lens, the, the, uh, uh, like, the reticles and stuff, uh, or the optics are all in here, which is kind of cool. Um, let's see. I think I'll be okay without it. Um, four times high caliber we need that and i think i will go with wait i i won't really need a hip fire so i'll do the extended and i'll just do one of each and then we'll see what goes what happens from there camouflage yeah i think this is probably the best camo right here uh extended mag oh nice you can get it so it's like from the side that's cool so it's just like the old classic world at war version I wish they had a, a fast mags, you know, that would be sick. I may need to do a quick draw for this. Let's just see how it goes. Um, steady aim when from the hip. Uh, how's the fire rate already? It's already at 9, so it would make it 12. That's crazy. Uh, I'm going to do quick draw and let's see. What's the other one I wanted? Uh, let's do from. I guess we can do that. <clears throat> Code ninety eight K. Which one should I do? Yeah, I don't know where the Commonwealth is. I love that gun. It's not this one though. I think they may have just removed it. Which is the best sniper, by the way? Ten damage, jeez. But the fire rate is slow. So it's probably best one is probably the Carabin. So I'll go ahead. Put a camo on. That looks okay. Uh, hopefully it's good. Zooming in. Rapid fire rate. I'll need that. Extended mag. That. Reduces sway. And. How much. Damage is already good. Yeah. I'll do this one. Because it makes it more balanced out. Hopefully it looks good though. Actually. I don't know if I actually like the. F the. Uh. Wait, increases damage to surfaces, extra damage against streaks. I don't know if I like the 4K optic from before, so I'm just going to leave it like this. And then last but not least, shotguns. Uh, I'll do it for the sawed off. Um, quick draw. Um, shoot. Nah. Steady aim. Rapid fire rate. Uh, and this. I'll just do that for now. Actually, let me do this one more. I'm sorry if I'm taking a while. I'm just I'm trying to get used to the game. Um, I need fire rate for this one for sure. Um, 
Yeah, I think I'd, I'd like that. Okay. Now, really quick, before we start... Wait, what's the OCA? Calling card? Oh, okay. Do you have any good ones? Uh, I'll just stick with the top one. Clan tag. Probably won't show it, but I'll do... Taco, just because it's the one I always do. Don't really know why. It shows up the, the right side, in case you guys want to know. Um, settings... I need it like at six. Sometimes I do a little bit higher, like eight or whatever. Zombies main menu. Would you like to exit and return? Exit the. Well, yeah. I, I thought I was in zombies. So look really quickly. I'm gonna just just check to see if I'm online. Cause I would actually like to do the prologue first. Uh, if it lets me. If not, I may have to just wait a while. So like I can actually get online because I don't think it's gonna let me do prologue if I'm in local play um, Dude, I'm not even gonna lie. I'm actually kind of nervous. I've already seen gameplay I see how scary it is, but just for me to be able to play it like I really need to be playing with friends If I want to play Nazi zombies, <laughs> it's scary dude like uh, And uh, keep getting this magic. So I think I'm gonna just uh wait a little bit until the uh servers are back and then i will see you guys in just a little bit okay we're finally in uh zombies and um it took a while for the servers to come back on but they have been working fine and i mean i can't play online so i had to do like solo stuff including multiplayer but uh dude i am uh, i'm scared and excited to but mostly scared. Uh, I need to play with friends if I, in order to deal with this. Okay, welcome to Nazi Zombies. Begin your tale with the prologue and witness the rise of the final Reich. Play the prologue. Um. Um. I've seen gameplay. It's pretty easy. I have no idea what I'm getting myself into. I'm gonna be scared. Get that picture. David Tennant. That's the uh, Doctor Who, right? Doctor Who guy, I believe. Ah, uh, dude, it's not good knowing that. Final right, dude. It's not good knowing that the my it's dark outside and my door is open. Good to see you all again. Oh, it was close, but I can see inside. Back to Scotland, the Fuhrer's own stash. Perhaps your finest hour, Captain Jefferson. Anytime I'm taking Nazis down to pay is my finest hour. Besides, these bastards had a Vermeer hanging next to a Valkenberg. Sure, they're both Dutch, but wrong damn century. Olivia. Your field work at Neuschwanstein led us to over 6,000 pieces stolen from private collectors in France. The Nazis have taken so much from us all. This art belongs to the people. And who can forget the Merkur's salt mine? Yeah, yeah, I know what I did, but hold your applause. I'd rather <laughs> find knob in a rolling donut before I bust my ass with your pennies again. <laughs> it's not worth it, mate. Duly noted, which brings us to Middleburg and the current operation. Dr. Fisher? Ten days ago, we received a dossier. Material smuggled out by a young Austrian scientist who's reconsidering his loyalties. In it, he provides the location of a hidden bunker where Dr. Straub and Colonel Richter had been collecting some peculiar pieces. Whatever they found, it's being used to power some kind of experiment. You have no idea what you're dealing with, do you? Your mission is to seize that relic. Everything else is on a need-to-know basis. Is it just me? Or does it seem that we're a wee bit late to the party? <laughs> I didn't sign up for this shite. None of us did. But here we are, and you have your mission just as I have mine. To find and rescue the scientist who risked his life to get us this intelligence. Klaus Fischer, my brother. I'm in antiquities, darling. Not search and rescue. Best of luck. Oh, shoot. What the hell was that? Oh, shoot. 
Yo, what? Um. Okay, then. Uh, well, that was fun. I guess I can, uh, I can stop the video now. Oh, shoot. Am I controlling it? Oh, sweet. Drosten, Olivia, Jefferson. Okay, I can't get off. Shoot, dude. Oh, shoot, dude. This is creepy. What the? What is that sound? What is this? Close mentioned strange devices. Oh, what the? It closed my wounds. It did. Dude, what happened here? Oh, there's a zombie over there. Okay, alright, L2 and O2. Oh, uh, uh. That soldier here <sighs> should be alive. This is great. Open notebook. Farmhouse. I remember that farmhouse. It's a ghost in place. Octoon Minen. I think that's how you say. More of those broken soldiers. Oh shoot. <laughs> Seven fifty jolts. Uh. This, okay. Oh, are you you can't. Oh my God, they just screwed us. I need to kill these creatures to open this door. What is this? MB40. Nazis use this energy from the dead to unlock the arms cache. How efficient. Okay. Wave two. What's this? This was too quick, right? What the heck, dude? We get some points. Hey, pony. Sorry. Uh, I don't know if I should or not. Shoot, they can just climb up through here. Dang, dude, I hate that the screeching sound. Do not mean to drop out here. Who's talking? Where are the zombies? Don't we freaking do it. Dude, I'm not liking this. Okay, so you can buy yeah. twenty five hundred to come in waves. More appear with every search. Just gotta get some headshots. Dude, this is freaking scary. Wait, you can't reveal barriers? Free fire? Oh, this is that, that thing. Unlimited ammo. I don't know if I should use it now. So let's just try it.
Okay, I just, oh shoot. Oh god, dude, I just jumped. Dude, this is an intense round three. Okay, it ended. Alright. We're good to go. Bastard. Oh shoot. Ah, dude. Oh my god. I'm getting it out. The town is ahead. I hope the others made it. Dude. That was <sighs> just for the prologue, like it didn't get bad till the very end. Wait, 29 headshots? What? That's pretty good. When I saw some people playing, I said like 290 something kills with 308 headshots. It was kind of weird. Okay. Now I'm only... Oh, dude, if I just got one more kill, I could have been ranked two. Dang. Okay, uh... Progression. Nothing. Yay. So I guess you can go back and do the um, prologue whenever. Get in the fight, public max. Nazi zombies is best played cooperatively. And public max, you will be automatically maxed with a team of other online players. By playing, you will start earning experience and unlocking new features. Get in the fight, custom max. You can also create custom maxes to invite up to three players. You still you will still earn experience while playing in a custom max. That's probably what I'm going to be doing most through the year, unfortunately, because I would want to do public, but like, my internet is pretty, as like David Tennant said, is pretty shite. <laughs> so, um, it's, um, uh, it's tough, but like, I, I would prefer playing like with other people because it seems, it's pretty scary to be honest. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> I can't, I'm not really good at handling with this kind of stuff. So we got replay, prologue, custom max, public max, multiplayer, and campaign. Um, so if I do the final Reich, I thought this was supposed to be a second map. Ready up to select your loadout. Okay, so this is just the stuff from before. <clears throat> uh, I don't know if I'm ready for this map, man. <laughs> I'm a little scared. Uh. Ah, uh, I don't, what do I, what am I doing? Weapon. Alright, so this is just the same stuff from before. Except the nice thing is that I have this camo right here. Dude, that looks so sick. That's the first time I've seen it, like, actually used. I finally figured out how to get these uh, pre-order bonuses, so um, now I can actually put it on. So let me put on everyone. It looks sick. Um, uh, and paint jobs aren't available yet, but they will be coming soon, thankfully. Dude, this camo looks sick on every gun. That's one of the coolest camos that I've seen in a Call of Duty game in a while. It's like the own version of Dark Matter. <laughs> uh, machine pistol. This pistol look Piddle. This pistol, it looks extremely tiny. It's really weird. Like, maybe it's made out of plastic or something. Dude, MP40. Oh my gosh, it covers the clip too. It doesn't for this. Dude, PPSX, please cover the clip. Please. Oh, it does. I like it more on the MP40, but dude, that looks sick. This looks, it looks like a pack of punk shamo. I've seen what the pack of punk camo looks like. It looks really nice. It's like the same style, but it's like a, a light blue mixed with gray and stuff. It's pretty nice. Uh, oh, dude, LMGs. Oh, I like that. Come on, show the... Yes, it covers the disc, too. That's sick. Okay, that's pretty good, too. And come on, cover most of it. Yes. Dude, that is sick. Coin 98K. I wasn't always the biggest fan of the Card 98K from like World at War. Because, you know, it's, it's like a simple gun to buy, you know? <laughs> but like, you know, maybe it'd be different this time around. And last but not least, we got shotguns. 
Um, and shoot, I messed up. Oh, dude, it looks nice on this. Dude, I am excited to play this game, but scared too, but excited too. <laughs> uh, consumables. Consumables are one up, uh, one use items that provide discounts, spawn power ups, or temporary temporarily grant powerful weapons, among other things. Uh, no consumable equipped. Uh, wait, so equip your consumables here. Consumables are used up when activated. Rare consumables can be used more than once. That's nice. Self revives uh, can be used to pick yourself up from last stand up to two times per max. No need to equip self revives as they are automatically equipped. Okay, so how do I. So I got these. Guarantees the next weapon that will be assembled by the mystery box. Okay. Oh, the MG15, that's pretty good. Uh, three chargers. I'll learn all this stuff eventually. And then they have a bazooka one. That's cool. Equip a flamethrower. That's sick. Hopefully it's good. Uh, full meter. So, <clears throat> oh, that's what it means. Okay. <clears throat> Excuse me. I was always confused what this meant. But it just means that, like, that little meter you have for when you have all the other stuff, it means that it'll, um, you know, like do it faster, which is nice. So I'm gonna put that on, and I will put on. Let's see, what's the other one I should do? Provides if it's 50% off discount on any Blitz machine purchase. I think that's the. I think I forgot what Blitz are. I'm not t entirely sure, but that may be the perks. But I could be. I'm probably wrong. I'm gonna do. Uh, I don't want this because I'd like to see what I can actually get. I'm gonna do. What should I do? I'm gonna just wait 25 percent off discount. I'm just gonna go ahead and do the double jolts, just cause. Um, weapon kill. Okay, so I already did that, dude. I'm scared to play this. Uh, uh, I don't know what I'm doing. 